All right, so I'm going to show you how to submit your assignment through Google Classroom if you are using an Android phone, meaning it's not an iPhone. So this is one of my students' classroom. And I'm going to click on one of the classes. So this is from what he sees. And right here, you can see uh, the announcements from the teachers and go back. So how that like you can get lost in this, right? For easier look at it, click on classwork. So it says quarter four right here. So, and these are your assignments only for quarter four. So one, two, three, four, five, six assignments. You see that presentation summary is for everybody. So everybody has to do it. These ones are only for those who cannot do eye ready. And this is assignment one, two, three, four, and five. I will be uploading six, seven, and eight, nine, and 10 later. So you kind of have time to do it now. Um, presentation summary, so let's get to it. So this summary is based on the presentation that we as a class watched in the library and after you can write this um, work back in your notebook, which is absolutely fine. Or um, like uh, if you want to type it in your phone and take a picture of it, like a screenshot, absolutely fine. How you submit it. So look right here. You click on your work right here on this. Let me show again. Um, presentation summary. You click on this arrow right up, right? So here I already created a Google Doc file for you. You can look at the sentence, go back. You can look at the sentence starters in here, right here. This is how I expect you to start your work. You can write it on a piece of paper. So you have a full, um, you have two paragraphs, sorry. So then how you submit it, how you submit it on an Android phone, the easier way, because I don't want you to get stressed out about it. So you click on add attachment. So look right here, you have a couple of options. You can take a picture. So you click on take a picture, it'll go to your camera. And from that, you can attach it as your picture. And that's absolutely fine with me. And then you click on turn in your work. So this would work for me. Um, if we look at the other assignments right here. So if you are doing the iReady assignments, right? So you click on it right here. So you first read what I expect from you. Like I told you right here. So each assignment is worth 100 points. You scroll down. So here I will want you to read the article and listen to it. So you have options, listen and read. Then what I want you to do, I want you to write a summary and submit it. Sentence letters are right here, right? So same way how you submit a summary, you click on your um, arrow, right? If you write it on your line paper, take a photo. Add an attachment with a photo, absolutely fine. And then click on turn in. Other assignments, um, let me quickly go back because my phone is doing something. Okay, so other assignments, assignment number two. Look at it right now. Same thing, it's 100 points. So you will need to listen to the podcast right here and you will write your short summary same way how i showed it to you before assignment number three so in this assignment you will read the beginning of a story you will need to write the ending of your story which should be at least 100 to 150 words it's not one sentence it's not two sentences count your words please same way write it on a line paper submit it as a picture Assignment number four, 
So in this assignment, we, you're going to be reviewing context clues. So watch the video on YouTube. Then you're clicking on the Google Forms for your practice. Here for the Google Form practice, it looks like this. So you're going to have um, questions, right? And you will need to choose one answer option. Look at the clues. So you, you will answer your questions. Some questions you will actually need to type in your answer. So you will have to type it in. And at the very end, you submit it. Okay. So after you do it, after you submitted it there, you click on here and you click on mark as, do mark as done. So I know that you finished this assignment and I will get uh, an email about it. So for assignment number five, you will read the article about TikTok and complete in a, some activities in Google form. Same, the article about TikTok is right here. You click on it. All right, so it's loaded. You read it, done. Then you open your Google form. So here it'll ask you to sign in. So you will just sign in with your account and it'll prompt you to your Google form. Okay. So let me know if you have any questions. All right. Thank you.